Hello everybody and welcome to the Letters Page. I'm Sal. I'm Ben. And I'm Tiffany. This is the show from Comic Pop where we open up your letters and packages and show you what's inside. Today, due to a shipping error, we have an extra DC uh, Legion of Collectors box, which can be yours! Find out how to win it at the end of the episode. This is from Anton, down in Louisiana. Oh man! Oh no! Somebody watch the live show! <laughs> uh, Tiffany, I think you should open this one. <laughs> Is. Freaking what? By the way, well, uh, there she is. <laughs> There's no letter, huh? The last name, Anton. Uh, no, no letter. But oh I think we God. know what's going to be happening on Comic Con. There's no way we're going to do this. <laughs> what are you talking about? Of course there is. We got it. Someone sent that specifically to us. Fair enough for a back issue. We'll see what happens, but oh there'll be something God. about it. Good I'm lord. Gonna... <gasps> Look. Oh, there's a afterward by Pamela Anderson herself. No, it's not by her, it's just about her. Oh. So thank you, H. Yeah, thanks. Yeah! H. What the H? <laughs> nice. Oh my god, I'm gonna read this! I am really excited for this. Yeah. That's awesome. <laughs> now a major motion picture. Ain't it just... Good lord in heaven. <laughs> thank you. Yeah, <laughs> Dear Comic Pop crew, congrats on 40,000 subscribers! I jumped on a couple of months ago, and you'll quickly become my favorite channel on YouTube. Yes, thank you very thank much! You. I'm sure you guys will hit 100,000 sooner rather than later. That's <gasps> nice to say. Anyhow, on to the good stuff. I've sent y'all a few interesting books. First is a book I feel was one of the most overlooked of the New 52, which is called mm. I Vampire. What? Vampires? Oh, yes. <gasps> that looks awesome! Yeah, it does. That is crazy. Ooh, by Josh Fialkov. Let me see. Vampires. It is very well written. Uh, it's a tale of vampires, magic, and love, but isn't a Twilight clone like some other people thought from the cover and the title. Hmm. It also has some awesome art by Andrea Sorrentino, who did uh, Old Man Logan, the new book. Oh, nice. Uh, yeah, who would really go good. on to become famous for his work on Green Arrow uh, and Old Man Logan. Speaking of the next book is the volume of Lemire and Sorrentino's Green Arrow. Oh, it's got a Jenny Freestyle nice. cover. This is Jeff Lemire's run on Green Arrow. Nice. Awesome. He's cool. We are doing Green Arrow on Baggages in the future, so we'll see how that goes. It is great. Finally, since I feel the world needs more of Sal's amazing Alan Moore impression, here is a collection of Moore's DC work. Wow. Whoa. That's awesome. Cool. Holy crap. Thank you, DC by Alan Moore. That's amazing. Hell yes. I know what's in here. This is going to be great. Um, including his most famous DC work like Voodoo and Vigilante. Oh, and some random stories that no one has ever heard of, like For the Man Who's Everything and Whatever Happened to the Man Who's Far. Which, of course, is the thing that everyone remembers. Uh, anyway, best of luck with the channel. Keep being awesome. Sincerely, John. Thank you, John. Thank this you. is awesome. This is a great haul. Hell yes. Wow. That book looks crazy amazing. I know. I'm really enjoying it. And I can't wait to see this. Joel from Kate Joel hypes this book up immensely. So we'll see if we can put his Hi -hi. money where his mouth is. The, the person, Jenny Frison, or Frison, yeah. I love her art. She does the covers for these. She's done covers for a lot of things I like, like yeah. Revival and stuff like oh. that. I love her. <gasps> it's Constantine! Uh-oh. Yay! Oh, a package within a package. Hmm. Oh. It's still from Miles. Nice. Oh, Alabama. thank God. If this was somebody else's thing, he's like, I'm sending that. Please open our letters page. Hey. You it's ask. happening. It's happening right now. Also, Batman's on the envelope. Nice. Yeah, he is. That's how it got here. It's oh, fun-looking Batman. That's why he was in the box. Yeah. <laughs> That's his cape. I was just thinking because he was being stealthy. Or it's like the end of that um, the, uh, Riddler episode of the animated series where yeah. he gets in the box. Oh, the giant safe? Oh, yeah. yeah he jumped yep. in the safe. Keep himself safe. Okay, Miles, you and tape, man. <laughs> <laughs> He's a couch on the inside. <laughs> That's our Yay. couch. Yay! Yay! Nice. Tape stash. Okay, by pulling out the envelope, it's going to reveal what's in here. Or we're pulling out the, the letter, so right. right off the bat. <laughs> oh, that's Ooh. awesome! Hang on. Mr. Batman J. the Animated Series Joker with hat. <gasps> and his Tommy gun! <laughs> <laughs> you go. You can play with that while I get this water out. Clearly, someone knows that we like toy conventions. Yeah. <laughs> There's another picture on here. Nice. Okay. Here we go. Ready? It's like, yes. Don't forget, I'm a, I'm a poor reader. Right. 
I mean, I'm a fine reader, but yeah, it's but out loud, it's where do it's it goes. aloud. Here we go. Okay. Dear Comic Pop. That's us. Well, then it got the right place. <gasps> My name is Miles. And he also put his last name, but... Yeah, well... Yeah. Yeah. I'm 13, and the highlight of my day is watching your videos. Nice. Thank you. I got really into Young Justice, the TV, or TV show. Right. And went into my trusty local comic shop to see if it was a, if it was a comic. It was! Ever since, I've been knee-deep in comic books. I was debating on buying the 3 million page Nightfall, but I heard mixed reviews. I went on YouTube and found the back issues on it. Ever since then, I've been watching every episode of every show you've done. Wow, thank you. I watched the back issues on All-Star Batman and Robin. Take a breath. The Boy Wonder. <laughs> yeah, that's a long title for no reason. <laughs> that is my favorite aside from Shadows of the Empire. Nice! Hey! hey somebody likes Shadows! <laughs> Thanks a lot. For my birthday, July 13th, I got The Dark Knight Returns, The Killing Joke, and Batman Year One. Wow. I finished them all the next day and watched the back issues on the two you've done. Uh, do Killing Joke, damn it. Yeah, we'll get there. I'm currently reading Kingdom Come, and I love it. Your show has pepped up my spirits when I'm down, and I just wanted to say thank you. Well, I don't want to make you die of old age because this letter letter's so long. Um, I should get on with the questions. Oh, yeah. Here we go. One, have you, Sal... Red Sin City, and would you ever consider doing it on back issues? Yes, or back to both those questions. It, sorry. Yeah. Uh, two, what's your favorite uh, superhero adaptation, movie, uh, comma, TV? Oh, man. I don't know. I mean, Avengers is pretty great. Iron Man. Um, yeah, that's pretty fantastic. Those are good adaptations. You guys? Oh, that's an excellent question. Tough though, how does one gauge one's response? Uh, you know, super flight, uh, <laughs> key detection skills. Um, probably the Batman animated series, since it was, oh, uh, no, X Men animated series. <laughs> yep, X Men. Obviously, it was Wildcats or Barbed Wire. No. Naturally. Um, <laughs> <laughs> um <clears throat> I think Guardians of the Galaxy did a really good job of capturing the spirit yeah. of their book. Because um, I was going to say Batman, the animated series. Batman the animated series is a given. That's um, like, you might as well call like, it the Batman yeah, the animated like series you award. Just don't even have to. Um, yeah. Well, to that to that extent, though, I think Justice League Unlimited. also, yeah, was, it was fantastic. fantastic. Um, so, yeah, yeah, there you go. Okay. Uh, I'm also going to throw in uh, Avengers Earth's Mightiest Heroes and Spectacular Spider Man, the cartoon. Oh. And Hulk vs. Wolverine. Yeah. Anything else? Nope. Oh, sure? and. <laughs> no, no. Um, and uh, three, what was the first comic you ever read? Uh, first comic book that I ever read was probably one of the first Batman books, like Batman number one or Detective 27, because a family friend owned those books and kept them in their china hutch. And when I would sleep over, uh, she would just put them in the, on the kitchen table where I'd eat cereal. And she'd be like, here, you look bored and I have nothing to entertain you with, so here's some comic books. So, yeah. My first comics are probably the first Batman's ever printed, which is like nightmare fuel, because like those are long gone, and I like read that you know they were oversized slightly, and so I would like read them and like eat cereal over them because I didn't think that they were worth well, hundreds were, of thousands. They were stories. Of You're dollars. just like, yeah, I'm reading a fun thing. Yeah, yeah. They were not true with any. Well with cereal. Yeah, no, yeah. it's true. Oh yeah, I still eat cereal today while I'm watching or reading my stories. Uh, I'm guessing it was probably Spawn Batman and Batman Spawn. Yeah, you got and, both of them. Yeah, I did like, at the same time. Um, and also, along with that, I also got a part of uh, X-Men Age of Apocalypse and Deathstroke the Terminator. Nice. I gotta say, out of all of them, Spawn Batman was my favorite, followed closely by Terminator. Yeah, Deathstroke was Deathstroke cool. Deathstroke was a great book. I never read comics when I was a well, kid because, go. like, my family didn't know of their existence nor care. Like, the closest thing would have been like Calvin and Hobbes because my grandpa That's a was comic. a huge fan. There you go, Calvin and Hobbes. Boom. Technically. That's fantastic. <laughs> he would leave out these giant books. Yeah, it's better than going to the library for the Garfield digests. <laughs> Other than followed by that, probably man like manga of some kind. Mm-hmm. But then shortly thereafter, it'll be comic books. It'll be comic books, all kinds of whatever you. Like, whatever. Yeah. Like all, all sorts of things. Anything you get your hands on. Technically, Preacher was one of the first comics that was given to me, and I was like, what? Yeah, what is happening? <laughs> uh oh. This is crazy. What? Oh. Thanks, guys, and Tiffany. 
That's me. That's me. Are you trying to shoot me with the Joker? Just pointing. It would be amazing if this was gun. featured on Letters Page, but I just want you to read it. Thanks for making my day better. Miles. P.S. Enjoy Joker plus a Tommy gun. Thanks, Miles. Which you happen. I will. Time. Yeah. yeah. I will continue great. to enjoy this, and we'll continue to enjoy <gasps> these amazing books you sent us. Thank you so much. Yeah. He and can, thanks for watching. He can write right on top of your... My Batmobile. Batmobile. Yeah. 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 Try and get in. So thank you, get Miles. Batman. That's awesome. This is going to be great. Where are you, Batman? Yeah. I was just shooting the crap out of the out of the car. That's right. So anyway, we got some amazing books. We got some sweet action figures. Uh, and some, of course, incredible letters from you guys. Thank you so much for sharing yeah. with, them, with us. Uh, sending them to us. We really, really appreciate it. And we'll see you guys next time with another episode of Letters Page. Uh, if you want to send us a letter or package, you can do so by sh doing it care of Comic Pop, uh, P.O. Box 1157, Danville, New Jersey, 07834. It's in the description box below this video. Just go there, copy it, send it out, and we'll probably open it on an episode of this uh, show. Yeah. So uh, thanks a lot for watching, everybody, and we'll see you next time. I'm Sal. I'm Ben. And I'm Tiffany. Bye. Now we've come to it, the end of the episode, where you can win your copy of this box, or this box itself, actually. It's literally this box. You're going to get this one. Uh, if Maybe we'll sign it. Yeah, all right. Ben might lick it. If you want your own box, you can go to legionofcollectors.com and get one every single month. Uh, this one, I didn't like it. in particular, will go to you. Uh, if you leave us a comment below using the hashtag FirstComic and let us know what your first comic book was. If you do comment and share with us what your first comic book was and use the hashtag FirstComic, you are entering into an agreement between us and you where you want to receive this box. And you have to have an address. So when I reach out to you via the YouTube channel and I send you a message, you will A, check the messages, and B, respond to the message with your address. Wait, wait, hang on. Maybe you should tell them when you will respond oh, yeah. by. Uh, we will respond by September 30th. That's right. September 30th, I will... That's... Yeah. September 30th, I will make my official decision about who will receive this box and then contact you and send you the details and get your address and then we'll mail it out to you. Like it. Oh. <laughs> Yay, Amy, you actually you, licked it! You're gross. You're gross! <laughs> you guys stink! You bunch of poopy heads! No, God! Give me, give me the box! Give me! Give me it! <laughs> You're like, I'm gonna draw a circle around where he licked it. <laughs> nice. Pen licked here. Please don't use that saliva to clone me. Yeah. There should be only one of me. <laughs> Yeah, you should be limited to one or less. Whoops.